Good morning, everyone. Welcome back. I am, I was gonna say I'm excited, but like, why? Welcome to another work week in my life video. I'm waiting for a lift to come grab me to take me to work, um, but just wanted to check in with you guys real quick. So the site visit on Monday that you guys saw went well. Not entirely how I would have expected it to, but it was cool. It like blew my mind that I was a part of, that I am a part of something like that. Yeah, it's like the longer I'm an engineer, the more I respect the profession, which sounds, I don't know if that's an okay thing to say, but let me tell y'all how my morning has gone, okay? This morning, I woke up at 4.30, right? Laid in bed for like 10 minutes, got up at like 4.40, um, had to take care of some laundry real quick, then hopped in the shower. Okay, I got this new thing. I will put a picture of it right here. I thought, it's not what I thought it was. I thought it was like a like the curling iron part. I thought it had like a brush, like bristles on it. So I was like, cause I saw it and I was like, dude, this might be perfect because normally I blow dry my hair with the Revlon One Step, right? And then like if I want curls and I just use my curling iron and I was like, well, let me, this might just take out that extra step, right? Just go straight to dry curls. <laughs> so, I used it and I started using it at around like six, okay? Cause I was like, I only have 15 minutes. We'll see how this goes. And so I started with this, I don't know, this section, the straightest section, okay? It's harder to use than the Revlon, the normal Revlon 1-step in my opinion. And it, it did not, first of all, like I said, I thought it would have bristles. It didn't have bristles, which meant that it wouldn't smooth out my hair while curling. So I did not do this section very well, which is why it's the straightest. <laughs> um, and then like when I did have my quiet time with my cousin, um, I had like, I still had my crown of hair, right? In a clip on top of my head. And then this side was still in a bun because I was trying to keep it wet. We have 95% um, CDs, which are construction documents due tomorrow. And we have like all these changes we're making. You guys know how in the last vlog I missed my hair appointment. I rescheduled it tomorrow at 11 a.m. And like before Christmas slash New Year or whatever. And I was like, okay, so I asked my boss if I could work from home. He hasn't answered me. I would hate to pay for four lifts. Like that's just doing a lot. Yeah, anyways, but I'm excited about tonight because we are doing some goal setting. Originally, it was just supposed to be me and like two other sisters. I mean, we can't tell other people that they can't join. That's just like rude. So we have two more sisters joining us. So we're just gonna do, we're gonna make vision boards, which I have mixed feelings about. I would rather literally just make a list of goals. <laughs> um, so I bought some washi tape um, because the only washi tape I had was like Halloween washi tape and they were like, eh. <laughs> Okay, I need to go cause my lift is here. Um, but yeah, hopefully it'll be a good day. In terms of outfit, oh, real quick, sorry. I wanna show you guys these earrings that Alex got me there. Just like, they're so cute. They're little bats and they glow in the dark. Aren't they so cute? I was like, thank you. Yeah, anyways, okay, I gotta go. <laughs> So sorry if you can hear the heat going in the background, but um, it's clearly later at night and um, I'll talk about how today went later um, tomorrow. But right now, before Alex gets home, which honestly I'm surprised he's not home yet. Um, I hope he's okay. <laughs> Real quick, I got this off this thing 
off of Amazon and I wanted to record myself using it for the first time just to see how it is. I just finished um, soaking my skin with a hot towel. It says to do that for three to five minutes. We'll just, so it's on level one right now. Honestly, that's like, you can't even feel anything. You can kind of feel something. I'll try three real quick. Oh my gosh, that's freaky. Wow. Pretty sure I just bruised my face <laughs> I can't believe that was only the third setting like what the heck because the second setting didn't like it didn't even I don't know it just didn't feel like it maybe I just have skin that's more sensitive than I thought I mean it doesn't like hurt like you know how like when you have a bruise and you press it it hurts it doesn't hurt it just looks like it hurts oh gosh I'm Alex is gonna come home and he's gonna be freaking out like what did you do to yourself oh no maybe I should put on makeup <laughs> uh, okay so maybe let me try it again with the second yeah the second doesn't even like maybe I should have used the second okay don't use your finger as like a as a good testing I mean I guess kind of the back of your hand but it feels completely different like on your actual face and this goes up to five look three four five five you can feel on your finger I can't oh my gosh I think I'll, I'll put maybe I'll like put that video up on Amazon for people to see I do like it though I because when I first saw it on Amazon I didn't know if it would be good if it would actually work apparently it works so well that I bruised my face so mmm my poor face oh my gosh okay moving on I might send a text to your brother saying, yo, talk to your sister, that that's, she did that. <laughs> Neither of us need your brother coming over here and busting open the door. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll just, I'll just, I'll. guys so it has been quite quite the I don't know what to say quite the day quite the amount of time that has passed between now and when I last talked to you guys I don't even remember the last thing I filmed I think it was like I was at the salon or something I I feel like this whole week <clears throat> for the most part well really the past like two days or something I don't know I have no concept of where this vlog is at but I just want to sit down and give you guys an actual update um generally on how this week has gone but specifically the past like today and yesterday last night yesterday you guys ugh, i really wanted to show you my hair okay like it, it looked like way better 
yesterday but um i basically just had her add a bunch of layers obviously front pieces are the shortest and there's like well they're like here you know so just like i had i wanted more like movement it obviously looked better yesterday but i wanted like more movement right um and you can kind of see that and oh my gosh i got the b3 treatment I guess it did something, I don't know, but like, I mean, it looks shinier to me, I don't, I don't know. It's just like, my hair feels so nice. I love it, and um, yeah, anyways, so more layers, more movement, which is great. Um, it looks best when curled, obviously. She did curl it yesterday, but my hair doesn't hold curl well. Yeah, but I, I love it because and you know my hair and i had her trim all of it first so i had her cut like i think i had like an inch <laughs> at least of split ends to get rid of so i had her do that and then do the actual haircut so but as you can see the length is still there like which i appreciate and i'm just gonna keep growing it right but um i do love the fact that i have more movement now because before it was just very like because of how long it is it was just like very heavy, felt very heavy and weighed down, which is gonna happen with long hair regardless, but this is like, you know what I'm saying, what I'm trying to explain. <laughs> Moving on, I loved it so much. But, um, and I wanted to come home and show it to you guys, obviously, but work was kind of crazy yesterday. Like, it was just, yeah, it work was st stressful yesterday. Um, I had to hop on the computer as soon as I walked through the door, pretty much, like I, we had a deadline yesterday. Long story short is uh, me and one of my co coworkers just cranked cranked it out. Like, I mean, we can't like not work, right? We have this deadline, like we need to send it in today. So we did what we had to do, um, ended up working till about like 9.30. Um, I think my coworker ended up sending it through around the same time, like 9.45 maybe. Um, hang on, pizza's done. And then on top of that, you guys, Alex was so, sick and it was just so sudden and out of nowhere and like and to me in my opinion because he was fine that morning like i don't know he was it was just like and you know the helpless feeling you get when like your loved one is just it's it, it just sounds like they're retching their guts out like it sounds like they're dying they're not but that's what it sounds like and it just sounds so painful and you're like i wish i could just take it from you um that's what i felt like and it just it was it was a long night last night woke up this morning he felt better thankfully he just had like a slight headache and um he he said his back hurt a little bit too but and he i was like did you get today off and he was like nope and i was like bruh i would have asked for today off like <laughs> or you know like hey impromptu pto or something like i'm gonna eat my pizza <laughs> and get back to work so just wanted to check in with you guys tgif though okay oh my gosh Okay, so I'm gonna do my best to try to explain my vision board to you guys <laughs> before Alex comes back inside slash before the groceries are delivered. We'll see how it goes. So I clearly used washi tape to um, divide my vision board into categories because I'm a blue and I'm an engineer and I can't just slap things on a piece of paper. I need organization. So I broke it up into five categories as you can see. Up here we kind of like have spiritual, spirituality whatever type of goals um this photo is here honestly just because i liked it it looked nice it looked wow it looked wow it looked nice um i put this here just to kind of um remind me i guess that's what vision boards are for right but whatever this is here to represent the fact that i want to never miss a quiet time 
this or I guess next year in 2023 so whether it's at 4 in the morning or 11 o'clock at night I will I want to never miss a quiet time these two are um, I never want to miss a D time with Alex so it, literally every week continuing to cultivate our marriage I guess a healthy marriage so um, but primarily just making sure we get our weekly times together so there's that um, I don't have one on here for for this i just realized maybe there's two two more photos i can print but i also want to pray for at least 30 minutes every day and then the last one is that i want to baptize someone so at least one person preferably more but at least one you know we got to start somewhere so okay this is the next category um this one is category four and this technically only had actually i guess technically this one is the least one and this one, cause this one has two. So this one is honestly just produce better quality work at work. <laughs> Pretty straightforward, just get better at doing my job. Um, and I have Miranda Priestley on here because I love her, she's great. She's like one of my favorite people, characters, I guess. Um, next we have the financial or finances category. Um, but I want to pay off my student loan and then I still need to do the numbers for the other loan that we have, but for sure pay off um, one of the loans that we have. Um, our cards are taken care of, so I don't need to worry about that, thankfully. And then these two, well, maybe not this one, but I mean, it looks pretty, like, come on. Um, I want us to save up, hopefully, 12K. We want, I want us to go to the European Missions Conference. It was like forever ago, but I think it was like for Vlogoween. It was oh, back in 2018, I think, on my main channel. It should still be there, maybe, maybe not. Um, but I vlogged there, so, you know, I wanna go back, obviously. Of course I wanna be in London. I basically belong there. Um, and then these two I put here. Look at the pretty Rottweilers. I love them so much. Obviously, I want to save up for two dogs. Um, not both Rottweilers. I just couldn't remember the name of the, do the dog that Alex wanted. <laughs> it's like a big fluffy white one. Next one is life. And I put this in the middle because it applies to everything. <laughs> and just to remind myself because I am a perfectionist. I'm very all or nothing. Like, y'all don't understand. Like, I... It's a problem. So I put that there to just help me mentally. So I want to wake up every day, Monday through Friday at five. Of course it will be grace, so like 5.15, okay, I guess, whatever. But maybe I should have put no later than 5.30. But I want to wake up every week, um, Monday through Friday at five. And then for this one, I put, I want to, I don't know, I probably should have thought this through more before committing, but because <laughs> I don't know how this is going to work, but I want to, um, on my main channel, I want to post at least one video every month. And then I want to start working out three times a week. So yeah, I'm not trying to look like that, just to be clear. Like, I just want to get toned and maybe build muscle, I don't know, but not like that. I'm not trying to... I just, I just want to, I just need to move my body more, okay? I guess is what I'm trying to say. And also, you know, the mental fortitude that it helps you build. So also I put these on here because obviously I like what they say. And this one, <laughs> I put it here because if you tell me I can't do something, that'll make me want to do it and just prove you wrong. That's probably pride, but whatever. If it's something that I feel like I could be good at, if it's, cause, I'm competitive when it thing when it comes to things that I feel like I should be good at. <laughs> um, that I feel like that sounds wrong, but whatever. Anyways, so these two, I want to declutter the entire house. So that'll obviously happen throughout the year, one room at a time, especially the office. And then this one is because I want to make our or make the filming room downstairs into a guest room so it can so that it can i don't want it to look like this but um you know i just want it to double as a filming room and a guest room because we could be using that room way more than we are maybe um or at least make it more useful because you know if we were to have guests over they'd have to crash on the couch which isn't as it's not hospitable at all um could be worse but yeah so that's my vision board. I hope you guys like it. Um, clearly still needs some work. <laughs> so if you could think of any other like photos, like I'll take photo suggestions in the comments 
below um, if you care to leave any. But yeah, let me know what you think. Let me know if you have your own vision board. And yeah, I'm excited for next year. I'm going to end the vlog here. Say thank you so much for watching. Yeah, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you made it this far, leave. This is so random, okay? Just, this is why we do this. If you made it this far, leave a can of tomato sauce. There is an emoji of it, okay? Leave the can of tomato sauce emoji down in the comments below, okay? I hope you all have a fabulous Christmas and just relaxing weekend. I hope it's not too stressful. Um, remember you are loved. Um, and yeah, I guess I will see you guys next week. Bye.